Good morning. I have another toy unboxing. Um, I went to Walmart. I bought a whole bunch of toys and I came across these lock stars. Um, so these are just like little plastic locks and they look like little monsters and they have keys and then they have a hidden surprise. So I bought these because I thought they were adorable and it reminded me of another toy when I was a kid of the 80s. Um, for our cereal boxes we would melt like they had um, a series, I don't know how to explain it. It was like plastic locks, um, kind of similar to this, but they were a lot flatter. And I don't think you had a melody. I think they just came free in cereal. Remember, um, I know nowadays you can still get toys in cereal boxes, but in the 80s, like pretty much every cereal box had a toy inside. And I wish I had one to show. I know I have one somewhere, but I couldn't find it. But it was a flat plastic lock and it would have like a character on it whatever was popular like Gar I think I have a Garfield one so but they weren't as as high tech or not high tech but detailed as this because this has like you know it has keys to go with it it's just adorable and I think something hides inside so I bought six of them I think there was eight all together but two of them I didn't really like so I just picked these six that I like so I'm going to open them they're just adorable. I actually saw another unboxing video. Um, who was it? Oh God, I don't remember. What was... I saw another YouTuber. I can't remember her name. Why can't I not remember her name? She has blonde hair. She's about a farm. She's very popular. I just can't remember her name. So anyway, she gets the company sent her a whole bunch. And so that's how I knew about them. Again, stuff you buy because you thought someone on YouTube had it, so you had to have it too. That's like half my videos. I saw someone else on YouTube, so I'm like, I gotta have that. Alright. Oh. So I guess this is a checklist. Let's see, is this a checklist? It is a checklist. Oh, there's more than eight. There's, oh my god. There is a whole bunch. There was only eight different ones at my store at Walmart which I will never go to again. Oh my god. Both sides are full. Maybe they're going to like release them in stages because I only saw eight different ones at my store and I want that one. That's a shark. Oh, that one's a tiger. That one's a pirate. That one's a zombie. Oh my god. This is bad looking at this. I want them all. There are some cute ones in there. Alright. So then this, I guess, is the mystery part. And it is, yes, it is. Oh, it's adorable. Maybe that's why they have that checklist because you add that to that. And I guess he opens, he's got a little hinge. And then this was the main purple. Oh my god, I'm not able to open it. So here's an itty bitty charm that is going to get lost in no time. Little keys. Oh my gosh. Childproof packaging. Another key. And then, sorry. Oh my god. I know this is probably loud. Sorry. Okay. There. He popped out. All right. I think there's something inside of him. So here's his purple key. And then twist it. And how does it open? Where is it? Okay, there. That came open. And then what happens? I think I messed up try it again is that okay so there's nothing inside that's just that's just his um gears that's what that is that's just his gear oh no he did come open his body opens his body opens and he had a little charm that's an eyeball I guess you just put him back in there interesting and then so he's a lock, so you put it like on your bag, your backpack, like a keychain. Adorable. That's adorable. And then let's see if this guy, I don't think this guy, this guy don't have anything, but you open him up. Maybe. This key's not working. This key wouldn't work. There's no gears inside of him, so this key is just for show as I got it stuck in there. I guess you really do have to be a kid to play with these because I don't understand. Okay. So, 
how does this open? Because there's no gears. I guess it just pops open. This is the hinge, so it should just pop on this side. But my nails are like, come on. I'm not breaking my nail over this. There. So he just pops open. So I'm going to put this little extra flower charm in there so I don't lose that. So you can't really stick them on a bag because those don't move. I don't know. Still cute, but I don't know that the freebie is worth it because you can't do anything with them. You know what I'm saying? This doesn't actually pop open like in this one does. So, put these to the side. Throw that on the ground. So the next one I got was this orange, kind of looks like a boom box, a radio, and the player is terrible. So, see, open him and block stars. Who makes Hasbro? Hasbro makes this. These are adorable. And these were nine, these were $9.99 in a package. Alright, so this surprise is, ooh, that's cute. That is very cute. And then the orange boom box. So the little, the little charm is, I don't know what, a film canister? I don't know what else that could be. A battery. I bet that's what it is. It's a battery, not a film canister. Everyone's like, if you're a kid, you're like, what's a film canister? Well, back in the day, before they had digital cameras, you had to have film to take pictures. Key. Key. And then the radio. Man, these. I'm gonna end up breaking it now and I'm gonna be not happy. Not happy. There we go. Look at that. It kinda matches my nails. Doesn't that look cute? Okay. Did I bend that? Okay. Yeah adorable so let's open him up to see what his little charm is come on there we come on there we go and his little charm is a what a heart just a little cute little heart i mean these are like this is nice but this is so small i mean this is way too small kids are gonna lose these in two seconds or swallow them definitely swallow them does this have an age warning, warning warning on the package? I don't see good things happening with these. Okay, that's, oh my god, and the key's stuck. There we go. Adorable. And then him with his, let's see if I can pop him open to put his little, now remember, the key is just for show on these, on the little freebies. Yep, he pops open, put his little, battery in there close him up I, don't, I can't even hear him snapping but this i do he's cute he's cute let's see if there's an age warning warning choking hazard small parts not for children under three personally i know my niece abby she still chews on stuff so i don't know what age group this is suitable for this is like a unicorn i think this is a unicorn i gotta take it out of the package this glare is terrible I'm just throwing this crap on my floor. My office is now a disaster. Okay. Checklist. I don't need 64. Okay. So the freebie mystery is cool. Like a cyclops. A pink little cyclops. It is cute. And then this is definitely, I would say, a unicorn. She's got her little rainbow horn. She's got a little rainbow tail. This one's very adorable. Very adorable. And this little charm. Not even suitable for adults. I already lost it. Cupcake. You can't even see it. It's so small you can't even see it. Okay. Listen, these are cute. Oh, and I didn't even notice. Like, even the keys. Like, the top of the key is a little character. 
I missed that on the others. See? No, you're not able to see it because my nails are... Okay, you can't see it, but it looks like a kitty cat or something, maybe a unicorn head. So even the keys are very detailed. Very cute. Very cute. But small. I'm gonna have to get a box to store all this stuff in. Alright, so let's open her up to see what her little charm is. Oh my god. Oh, it fell out. It is a rainbow. Rainbow. Put her charm back in. It matches her, <clears throat> excuse me, matches her tail, her cute little rainbow tail. This one is very cute. Very, very cute. And let me open up Cyclops and put her little charm inside her so I don't lose her charm. It says, it has writing on the back, it just says lock stars. That's good. Because when you misplace it, because you're going to, and you find it two months later, you can be like, oh yeah, I remember this. This is lock stars. Way too small. Alright. And then the next one is this is either a green cat or a rabbit. I'm going with a rabbit. mystery is um, a just a rabbit with a bow in the middle of her forehead that has another eyeball. Apparently she has three eyes. What's that called? A triclops? green bunny her little this little charm is a slice of cake again it's so hard to see and then the little key toppers oh my god they're little rabbits so cute okay well at least these keys have a little string on them so you can string them on your lock and hopefully not lose them so I I see kids losing these in two seconds flat. Okay, opening up her tummy, and it is a, I don't know, a raspberry, a purple carrot. She has a rabbit. I'm going to assume this is a purple carrot, because why not? There's such thing as purple carrots, right? Sure there is. Okay. Oh, that is if I can close her back up her lock back down take her key out cute 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 pop open triclops here put her little piece of cake inside of her and there you go they are adorable i don't know what i'm gonna do with them string them on something like a lanyard or something oh people this one in the display they have this is a uh, shoe and this is a um my mind just went blank backpack I really don't see kids running around with these on the back of their shoes. Not for sure why they put that as a display. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to buy a plastic, I'm going to go to Home Depot and I'm going to buy a length of plastic chain and I'm going to string these on a plastic chain. I know I've seen plastic chains before. I bet I'm, I'm going to go to Home Depot and then I'm going to show you guys when I'm done. This was a three-eyed alien, a triclops again. Is Triclops a word or did I just make that up? I could not have made it up. I'm not that clever. I had to have heard it somewhere. Okay, so then the surprise is a little pink something or other. And then that little charm is a high heeled shoe, because why not? And then this purple monster is adorable. And then the keys have little monster heads on them. Oh my god. This packaging is really tearing up my hands. Okay. So let's open let's open up till blue monster and see what's in the body. And the body is um it's a camera. It's an itty bitty camera. Very cute. Put that back. 
pop that close, take that key, key out, very, very cute. Open up this little girl, remember she just pops open, the key is pointless for that one. Pop her little high heeled shoe in her, there you go. And I, these keys are all the same, it's not, they're all the same. It's going to open any of the lock stars. Last one, this purple zombie, not necessarily a zombie, like Frankenstein, kind of like, or a zombie. Maybe it's, you know what, he's drooling. I think it's supposed to be a zombie. These are adorable though. I do like them. I don't know that I'll be buying anymore just because I do think they're a little small with, I will keep one checklist and check this for me. The rest I'll throw away. Um, they're, they're easy to lose. Okay. So the surprise is this cute red guy. And his little charm is like, I don't know, like a bug? Like a lightning bug? And then a zombie. So I guess it's good that each of the keys, even though the keys can be working on any of the locks, the keys heads are similar to the lock that goes with them. So you can keep them matched up if that's important to you. And then let's open, let's open this guy. Okay, in his body he has a, I don't know, he had, what is this? What? I don't know what it is. It is... It's just a shape. Maybe a mouse. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to focus so you could tell me what it is. But it makes no sense to me. How do people do this? It, it doesn't matter. It's itty bitty. It's this black. It kind of looks like a mouse. Maybe. Maybe. doesn't matter some in the some shape that makes no sense okay there we go so these are lock stars yes I like them will I buy more no too many little parts if everything fit in the body that would be cool but now I have all these keys oh wait let me I forgot to put her ladybug inside there so they gave two keys, even though the key doesn't do anything for this. I guess you could just stick it in the nose and leave it there, dangling, I guess. Is that one way to make it a charm? That's kind of hokey. Alright, the thing about toys is they don't have to make sense. They really don't. They just have to be cute, and you just have to like them. And I do like them. They are cute. So yeah, what I'm definitely going to do, you can't see it from right here, but I have, I have wall hooks. Um, that I have like my metals and my lanyards on so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna buy like two feet of plastic chain at the home the hardware store and link these on it and hang it on the wall um, they are adorable and like I said they were 990s let me double check this receipt that's a plush Lockstar. oh my god they're cheaper than I thought I was wrong Lockstar 488 I was telling you wrong 488 488 488 for two locks I kind of think that's a good deal that's not bad at all that's not I'm not gonna buy anymore but it's a lot cheaper than I was saying I was wrong I said I, I had bought a whole bunch of stuff if you saw my other videos I have like two or three other unboxings so I had bought some cutie fruities and that's what was 996 so these lock stars are 488 that is actually a really good deal you know what, these would make great stocking stuffers, um, just not for sure what age group is really appropriate for these. There is a lot of little parts, they're going to get lost very quickly, <laughs> but that's toys. That's, that's toys. You have fun for about two days and then you move on to the next toy. So, but they are adorable. Look at that. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please hit the like and subscribe buttons and I will see you later.